Welcome to PC Mac. Today we are going to install the heat sink on the Raspberry Pi. So I have cut three different shape heat sinks as you can see here from my old motherboard which is no longer in use. So I have cut these heat sinks to install them onto the Raspberry Pi. So let's get started. So let me first of all install the heatsink on the back of the Raspberry Pi. So let me take a little bit of thermal paste. I think that will be enough. So let me place my first heat sink right here. I'm moving it so the thermal paste spread over the chip. So the heat sink is installed now. Let me just press it once. Okay, it's installed correctly. Now let me move the board to this side and now I'll try to place the other heat sinks. Let me place the big one first or we can start with the small one. Let me take a little bit paste for my small chip. I think this will done the trick. Let me first of all place the heat sink to its position. Now let me put the thermal paste Okay, this one is good. Yep. Now let me put the heat the thermal paste here so I can put the last heat sink. I need to put a little bit more thermal paste because this chip is big. that will be enough so let me put the chip let me just cover the chip by using this big heat sink I am checking that it not covered any of the other components so it's good it's here now yep so all the heat sinks are correctly placed on the Raspberry Pi motherboard. Now let's get onto the system and check the temperature readings after we install those heat sinks right here. So let's get back to the computer. Thanks. So now I'm here on my desktop with Raspberry Pi started. So we will check the temperature again with the same script. So I'm running the script now and let's get started. So I have run the script again and with the time frame of 10 seconds. So as you can see the temperature instantly dropped down to 37 degrees Celsius. And let's see what will be the final temperature 
it's 36.5 we will check the 10 to 12 reading again to check what's the difference between the first setup and the second setup so the temperature is around 36.5 on the fourth reading So after installing the heat sink on the Raspberry Pi, the temperature moving in between 35 to 38. So the average temperature must be 36 degrees Celsius after installing the heat sink. As you can see, it's keep on dropping. Now it's constant on 36.5. So we will take one more reading and then we will stop. So it's constant on 37. Now it's 37. So let me just turn it off and copy it. And I'll create a new document again. and name it ras peri 53 with heat sink installed let me copy it and we will save it with the same name So we have two readings here. Let me just rename it as well. It's without heat sink. So we have two readings now. Now in the next video, I'll put this Raspberry Pi into a custom made box and then we will check what will be the temperature difference then and now. Thanks for watching my video. Bye bye. Take care. Have a nice day.